Hi guys, thank you for watching. Today we're gonna um, crop some 4K footage to uh, 1080p. And as you can see right here, I have some 4K footage of uh, Shasta Lake. And so the cool thing about 4K footage is when um, you are uh, working in a 1080p project, you can make a big uh, crop in your 4K footage without losing quality because you're working in a 1080p timeline. So when you have one 4k shot you can make two of it or maybe make a nice zoom in it and i'm gonna give you a short demonstration how you uh, do that so you want to start off with um, making a new project and uh, we're gonna name it like let's say demo um, 4k crop and so the, the, the important thing is that you uh, make a 1080p uh, project and not a 4k uh, project. So 1080p, um, so and then 25p. Now we're going to put it in the project event. So we have our project over here and um, I'm going to use this shot of the dam at Chester Lake. I'm going to demonstrate that you can make two shots out of this nice uh, wide shot uh, so when you are using this for uh, let's say b-roll um, you you now have one shot but we're gonna make two shots of it so you can play around a little bit with it all right and next we're gonna go to the transform tool here in the left and we are going to scale this shot to about let's say 170 percent most of the time that's how far you want to go without um, losing any quality. So I'm gonna frame it a little bit. Um, so the shot is looks nice. Um, and now I'm gonna say done. So now we have a close shot of that uh, wide shot we had. But there's also another fun thing you can do with this. Instead of transforming the whole shot, we now can say, um, we want to have a zoom in this shot. So we want to go from the wide shot to the close shot. So for this, we're going to start all over again and um, we're going to transform. And it's important that you uh, start at the beginning of your timeline. And then we're going to hit on the keyframe symbol. And then uh, we're going to go to a, to a new point in our timeline and from there on we can zoom the shot like we just did so and let's say we put it a little bit more to the top okay and it's this is cool we can press done and now we have like a very gentle and slow zoom from the starting point to the next keyframe point so now you can play around a little bit with um, the transform tool and the keyframes. Uh, you can make zooms, but you can also start close and then go wide or whatever. So, um, so the awesome thing with 4K now is that you can make more shots out of one shot and you can even now make zooms and, and stuff like that. So, all right, thank you for watching and uh, see you on the next one.